Today's bite test features an assassin bug, Reduvius personatus, also known as the masked hunter because of the nymph's habit of covering itself up with dirt and debris. This assassin bug does not normally feed on human blood, but I've heard it can give an excruciating bite. But let's find out what it feels like. You can see his beak here. Alright, he looks pretty upset. Come on, give me the beak. I'm definitely pressing with enough force that if he would... Oh, here we go. There, there goes the beak. Oh, right under the fingernail? Oh, that's gonna suck. Ow! Oh, that hurts. Okay, so at the side of the bite, there is a gnawing pain that goes... Ah, oh, that goes way down under the skin. And it just keeps building up and building up. It feels like it's going uh, right down into the bone of my finger. If a hornet sting is 10, I would rate the assassin bug bite at about a 7 for the first minute. After that, it trailed off into a 3 or 4. I don't recommend being bitten by this insect. It hurts. And a bored orangutan frantically cleans its mouth. Assassin bugs hunt by ambushing and stabbing their prey with a stout recurved beak. They inject digestive venom and then slurp up the slurry. There are many different kinds, including ones that specialize on bees and spiders. This Corsair bug pushes a drop of fluid out of its femur. This behavior has not been recorded before, but it may help the bug repel predators. One subfamily, the kissing bugs, parasitizes sleeping people and are a vector for Chagas disease. The vast majority of species, however, want nothing to do with humans and will only bite when provoked.